Thanks, Helen. Um, hi, welcome to one of our uh, pre-recorded uh, mini shows, Waltz and All. Um, and uh, what we're going to be doing, as per usual, that we have been doing on Facebook for quite a long time, but we're slowly moving things a little bit to YouTube. Uh, music from the 60s, essentially instrumentals and a bit of frivolity thrown in for good measure. A few slick dance moves going on as well that you might be able to you know, pick up on a bit. by the shadows. Hope you enjoyed that. Jeannie, what's going on? Well, you know my mate, Alec the Spy, he's, I've just found this thrown through my window in a and, and it's kind of confidential uh, and it says, um, could you meet me here, wear some flowers and this is all it says is Corsican fans. Wear some flowers and meet me in this place. Corsican fans, I haven't a clue. Hope you can help me out. So where do I meet Alan the spy for my top secret and highly confidential information? Corsican fans, wear some flowers, not a clue. Oh. And I think um, I think you might have mentioned it already, Jeannie, but that's uh, named after a 60s tune. So there's the clue, uh, if that helps in the slightest. Um, well, yeah, I can feel a bit of sort of surf music coming on. <laughs>
Fresh from the fridge, protected by the airtight lids on the pretty new tubs, the delicate, natural taste of Kraft soft margarine. We're going to do another uh, instrumental now, but this was based on a, 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 prop, a pucker song, and uh, this was recorded by the uh, by the Beatles and uh, released in 1963. It was actually the B-side to "I Want to Hold Your Hand," which was a massive, uh, massive tune. And I hope you enjoyed this one. This is called. This boy. was my instrumental interpretation of this boy recorded by the Beatles and um, of course featuring the fantastic uh, John Lennon and Paul McCartney on vocals. Hey Jeannie! Yes? I feel a touch of Salvador coming up. Oh I know, my friend, I do. Uh, my friend Salvador, he's, 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 had his, he's, he's had his palette out again and he's drawn me another fantastic picture depicting a song from the 60s. Now, it's showing somebody here with a calendar, 27th of June, 26th of June. Hmm, anybody figure out which tune Salvadori Abdi has, uh, has drawn here? Wow, that's a good one. Hmm, have a little think and I'll let you know later on. <laughs> Hey, good old Salvador, eh? Uh, right, I'm going to do another instrumental now. This is this is one of my favourite Shad's uh, instrumentals. Uh, it was uh, uh, hit uh, the charts in 1962, and it stayed at number one for for eight weeks and uh, and 18 weeks in total in the top 40. And uh, yeah, this was actually penned by the the same guy who uh, penned Contiki and uh, Apache, and his name was Jerry. Lorden. So I hope you enjoyed this one. This is Wonderful Land.
that was um, Wonderful Land by the by the Shads. Right, I'm going to be talking uh, 1961 and 1962 right now. Um, I'm going to major after this next tune. Uh, I'm going to major on a particular tune that was actually released in 1961, but it took a bit of time to hit the charts, and in fact, it was. Des pretty much destined for number one in the UK, um, but unfortunately, uh, this tune by Cliff Richard was quite stubborn at number one, and the result is uh, this. Ne the tune I'm going to be playing after. Are you following? No. The tune I'm going to be playing after this one <laughs> never made number one. I'm I'm distraught. I'm distraught. Um, anyway, here, forget all that for the minute, because I'm going to throw in a video explaining more about the tune that I'm majoring on after this one. But this one, I forgot what this one is now. Oh, yes, it's this. Young ones, you better believe it. And the young ones shouldn't be afraid to live, to love. While the flame is strong, as we may not be the young ones very long. the young ones and uh, yes it was a great hit in 1962 uh, but this next tune I'm gonna play if you're still following me uh, was 19 released in 1961 it was a very slow riser and never quite made it to number one but uh, 1961 was quite a uh, an amazing year too and Jeannie I think you got some information on 1961 I have. in 1961 the farthing coin worth a quarter of a penny ceases to be legal tender in the United Kingdom, having been in circulation since the 13th century. Mm. Wow. I know. John F. Kennedy is sworn in as the 35th President of the United States, succeeding Dwight D. Eisenhower. Disney's 101 Dalmatians is released in the cinemas. Aww. 
Uh, the Beatles make their debut appearance at the Cabin Club in Liverpool, the first of the band's 292 performances at the venue. Ballet dancing sensation Rudolf Nureyev, suspicious of the intentions of his home nation's secret police, defects from the Soviet Union and requests asylum in France. Uh, the World Wildlife Fund opens its first office in Switzerland. The Beach Boys record their debut single, Surfing at World Pacific Studios in Hollywood. And United Artists announces that the lead role in the very first James Bond film, Doctor No, is played by Sean Connery. So there you go, a few things that happened in 1961. Wow. Thanks, Jeannie. And now I'm going to um, run a quick video um, telling you all about this tune that I've been waffling on about for absolutely ages. Stranger on the Shore, recorded by Aka Bilk, was released in October 1961. It became 1962's biggest selling single in the UK, spending 55 weeks in the chart. Though, it was kept off the top spot by Cliff Richards' The Young Ones. It made number one in the US, however, and both the single and its accompanying album went gold there. Aka real name Bernard Bilk, claimed he thought up the song's melody in a taxi. He named this gentle tune Jenny in honour of his daughter. Bilk was by now famous enough to be asked to create the theme for a BBC TV children's series. Bilk offered them Jenny, but was asked to change its title to the name of the programme, Stranger on the Shore. Bilk was soon such a big star that his PR operation was playfully known as the Bilk Marketing Board. The song proved remarkably flexible and Bilk called it My Pension. As an instrumental, it attracted covers by Booker T and the MGs, Santo and Johnny, Duke Ellington and many more. It was also too successful not to acquire lyrics and there were covers galore, and the song was used in numerous movies. In 2012, half a century after the song's major success, Ackerbilk admitted he'd had enough of Stranger on the Shore. He grumbled to the BBC, It's all right, but you do get fed up with it after 50 years. I hope you enjoy my rendition of Stranger on the Shore. <laughs> Thank you. 
That was Stranger on the Shore. I'm going to uh, speed things up a little bit now. This, um, since we've been doing Facebook uh, gigs and various other th other things, this one's probably uh, uh, one of the most um, requested tunes, I guess. So uh, here we go, a bit of noise and bedlam for about six minutes.
Well, there you have it. That was Sabre Dance. Um, Jeannie. For you. I need some words of wisdom <laughs> after that one. I think we need one. to bring the temper down. <laughs> oh, we need to bring it yes. down. So over to Jeannie for yes. some lovely words of wisdom. <laughs> Let's have a little bit of calm in the room. Oh, yeah. After all that crazy madness. So, Jeannie's words of wisdom. Drop by drop, a whole lake becomes. Mm. That's good. Yeah. That's so true. It is true. Words have no wings, but they can fly a thousand miles. Mm. Oh, it, oh, it does, yeah, be careful. Lose an hour in the morning and you'll be running after it all day. Where's hey. that one I lost this morning? Thanks, Jeannie, that's fantastic. Oh, much better. And that drop thing's amazing, isn't it? So I suppose if you need to like, get a, um, a flood or something like that, only it's that final drop that does it, isn't it? Well, Tips it over the... The straw that broke the camel's back. The straw that broke the camel's back. It's the drip of the drop of the water. It's the drip of the drop of the water. <laughs> Why am I repeating ev you absolutely know, everything Jeannie it? says? I do it all the time. Still doing I'm still doing it now. It. Stop it. Just get on with it. Right, I'm going to do a tune <laughs> recorded by the Shads. Uh, this one is requested quite a lot. It's called Get Off. Um, it was uh, recorded in uh, March 64, uh, I think, and uh, or it hit the charts then. And it peaked at number 12, 10 weeks in the top 40. And it was the, uh, the only non-collaborative, collaborative, collaborative, so um, it was the only one where he, uh, he was the only one where um, he wrote it himself, and that was Bruce Welsh. He wrote this all by himself without any collaboration. I uh, hope you enjoy this one. Mo uh, this is requested quite a lot. Lovers by the Shads, a 1964 hit. Right, Jeannie, it's time for some answers. I demand some answers. You demand some oh, answers? Oh, yes. Well, you better go and knock old Salvadori up because I think he's gone for a siesta. Oh, siesta yeah. and a sangria again. So, earlier on, before he went for a siesta, 
Salvadori had to be, he drew us the picture. Is he up yet? <laughs> What's the answer? Sure, yeah. What's the answer to the artwork? That's it. Yesterday, man. Yesterday, man. Oh, brilliant. Oh, there we go. And then it was. It is when you know about it. It is when you know about it. <laughs> I'm repeat. I'm. St I'm repeating it again. Right. So we need now to find my mate Alan the Spy. So, Alan the Spy. Honestly, it's all crumpled up. Tell me to meet him here and wear some flowers in my hair. Corsican fans. So, where on earth am I supposed to meet him? Where is he? The answer is San Francisco. Wow, brilliant. <laughs> well, oh, he's such, a, that he's such a tease. San Fran, eh? Wow. Right, this has nothing to do with San Francisco now. This was a hit in uh, in, in the UK, actually, 1965, by a, a late, and a, a, a hopefully Jeannie's not going to replicate this right now. Um, <laughs> uh, but she tended to do a lot of her performances with her shoes off. Leave them on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll take my shoes off. You don't want that, baby. Yes, please. Here we go. I have waited a long, long time for somebody to call my hand. At last she's come along. But nothing can go wrong. If you believe that, if you live it, we'll meet every night at eight. I don't get home too late. I say to myself each day, baby, I don't know me close. The greatest thing I know now I sing and sing of the moon and stars above How long to be in love We meet every night and eight I don't get home to make I say to myself each day Baby I'm long, long in love nearly the end of our show we're going to finish with one more tune uh that was actually uh, recorded by the manfred man uh, band uh but it was written uh, by uh, bob dylan if you gotta go go now after this tune now listen Wanna be with me, but if you've got to go, it's all right. But if you've got to go, go now. Oh, now she got to stay all night. I am just a poor boy, baby, looking to connect. Say that to everybody. Certainly don't want. You're thinking now that I ain't got any respect. 
But if you've got to go It's alright But if you've got to go Go now Or else you've got to stay all night It ain't the I'm questioning you To take part in any quiz It's just that I ain't Got no watch in me me what time it is but if you've got to go it's all right but if you've got to go go now and she got to stay all night It's just an hour, you're sleeping soon It'll be too dark for you to find the door But if you've got to go It's alright But if you've got to go Go now Or else you've got to stay all night But if you've got to go You gotta stay all night Hope you enjoyed our little pre-recorded show. It's strange doing a pre-recorded one. It's very isn't it? strange, I know. It is. Oh, I prefer the live ones, really. But we're doing this just to tide over the next few weeks, and then we'll get back into live. Hopefully, yeah, I'm, I'm missing you all. I'm missing all your comments. Yes. And all your daft jokes. Oh yes, exactly. <laughs> and the nonsense. And the nonsense. Still doing it again. And the. He's, um, see, he's going to repeat everything I say. And everything you say. <laughs> You've been great, guys. Thanks so much for tuning in. Bring me sunshine in your smile. Bring me laughter all the while. In this world where we live, there should be more happiness. So much joy you can give to each brand new bright tomorrow. Make me through the years, never bring me any tears. Let your arms be as warm as the sun from up above. Bring me fun, bring me sunshine, bring me love. Right, here we go. Here we go. world where we live there should be more happiness so much joy you can give to each brand new bright tomorrow make me happy through the years never bring me any tears let your arms be as warm as the sun from up Bring me fun, bring me sunshine, bring me love. Bring me fun, bring me sunshine, bring me love. Thank you so much for joining us on this pre recorded We're missing our twang gang. We're missing our twang gang. We're going to go live uh, in a few weeks' time, hopefully. Possibly on YouTube, maybe Facebook. Who knows? Who cares? I don't. Do you? No, we don't. We don't. Right. Anyway, bye. bye, guys. Love you. Bye.